Hey guys, I'm Nagata Tim, and welcome to my reaction for Yoja Senki, episode 5. Yeah, I know, it's been a while. It's been a while, and I'm kinda apologizing for that. I, I really like it, I just didn't have a time, sadly. Yeah, I'm very busy, sadly. But I'm pretty intrigued how this will continue. Tanya kinda fudged up there a little because she was proposing this kind of like plan and she didn't know they would actually take it seriously. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah, because she kind of did not want it to be seen as someone who is backpedaling so much and she thought maybe that would be dangerous to think like that. So she like made up this and they, they kind of went with it. Yikes. <laughs> yeah, I feel like Tanya is going to be her biggest enemy. <laughs> Whoops. But uh, at the end, she was like having tons of paperwork and she was like, oh, I, I can spread this for such a long time and be like, oh my god, I did not have any kind of assistant. So much paperwork. I could, could not do it. <laughs> then they sent her an assistant, the girl. <laughs> Whoopsie, the the universe just hates her. <laughs> God, being X, it's your work, right? I'm sure of it. So, I'm just intrigued, and I guess I'm going to start it right now. Okay. Oh. Yep, she here. So she can help you with your paperwork. So easier to work together, I guess. He's like, damn it. My paperwork. No. Your plan is backfiring again. <laughs> She's like, damn it myself. Damn it. <gasps> yeah, she is her biggest enemy here. Okay. Okay. Oh. Apparently, guys. Oh. Keep it safe and sound. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, she's like sending them away. Yeah, my first battalion, that's what she's supposed to do. Yeah, they just use opportunity and goddamn these people. Oh. Nifty. Oh, very nifty. Mm, that's why she's sending so much of them away. Yeah, that's not many. 
they are not very happy. I mean, she she's gonna prolong in this. They are not very happy with that, though. Dumb. Will this work? What is your plan? <laughs> Even she's like, I feel... I don't feel like I'm liking this. I saw that Italy there! But... I mean, even if this world is kind of not the same as our world, it kind of is same as our world, kind of weirdly enough. -y. Fun for who? <laughs> Seems like it's fun for you. <laughs> I don't know about these poor people down here. Well... <laughs> I was thinking, what the hell is she doing? She dig a hole. <laughs> she clever. She's like, yeah, I see what's going on. <laughs> you... Sit Daisy. I mean, she crazy. <laughs> she did not need to go that far, but she like, I don't give a fuck. These poor guys. <gasps> oh no, these poor guys. How many survived? Them. But I mean, you need to kind of go through rough stuff if you are in a war, right? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Just doing all the fashion way. Five feet, I guess. Oh, th that's quite a lot. In a snow through the mountains. This is rough. And yeah, he's having a lot of fun with this deal. <laughs> but like, yeah, you kind of need very skilled people, actually. If it is like people in your battalion you're going to be depending on. Dogs. Animals. I mean, they are useful. I don't like it, but they are useful. Don't jinx it. Don't jinx it. I mean, she kind of knows it already, so she has advantage. Okay. But that wasn't the smartest move. Well, guys, swim. It's about time to swim. Trying to swim. And hope that you would kinda well Okay she out <laughs> I'll worried how many are underneath it <laughs> nothing Sorry for being hit by avalanche. Oh, 
Oh. You got some... Yeah. <laughs> she just made him spit it out, whatever. A bunch of snow or whatever it was. I mean, it, it's a rough environment and it's war. Okay. Oh, okay. You're just going. <laughs> She's like running off. Okay. I guess they're dedicated. Kind of good, but I don't think... Did she want this? Maybe she thought everyone would drop. Well, I mean, th that's a given, it's a war, you should expect that you might die and not come back, right? What a nice speech you're giving there, little girl. Yeah, hooray! <laughs> hooray! Oh, she's so down. She's so down. Well, you have your battalion, girl. She's so down. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, he doesn't like her much. Okay. I don't think they care. Oh. Mm, yeah, they just don't care. Even if she would want to prolong it as much as possible because she really doesn't want to go to, to the there. Yeah, they're just like, we need you there. Okay. Okay. On. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, really get, getting crazy. <laughs> Who? Hmm. Uh 
Interesting. I mean, they, they look kind of good. They look pretty good. Oh, really? How lovely! Yeah, do whatever you feel like to do. She's so excited. <laughs> oh my god. So be kind of careful. I hope. <laughs> no, no, that's stupid. Oh, a lot of people. Actually, but I mean, they're up there. They they have high ground, <laughs> better position. It, it's kind of easier to attack from a sky because, like, you can see better and yeah. I mean, yeah, they're very obvious targets, and it's kind of easy with your position up in the air. Yeah, they're kind of wrecking chaos. Ah, don't jinx it, girl. Don't jinx it. Do not jinx it. What? Crazy! Unconventional! Also, I think her voice actor of the girl is the voice actor of Shinobu from Demon Slayer, right? And I think Yor from Spy Family? I really like her voice actor. Yeah, they, these poor guys are being really slaughtered. Yeah, it was kind of... Oh, okay. They have some kind of strategy. Interesting. Yeah. Do they know something we don't? <laughs> Especially so high in the air. Don't be joking. <laughs> She's so mad. I mean... I I guess that's their only strategy. <laughs> I mean, why would they? <laughs> this is their strategical kind of plus on their side. Why would they go down there? Oh, wow. Ouch. Don't they have anything else? I guess no. They were just getting close together, kinda thinking that might what that might have helped.
Mm, intriguing. I hope it's not a trap. <laughs> Just you. I mean, the magic. That still would be probably very lucky because you could also enter as a dead body. So he's not going to be a dead body. Everyone else would. Yeah, there are going to be probably some valuable informations. Okay. Damn. Further in? Okay. She is very excited about it, like, yeah, let's go for her. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, poor people. <laughs> nice city. Yeah, there is going to be fireworks. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, it, it's like kind of sad, but in air they have a big advantage. Are you really going to do that or just you're saying it? What? Very believable, indeed. Well, duh. Don't piss her off. True. They've chosen not to believe it. <laughs> they they cannot they warn them. Fireworks are gonna happen. <laughs> Ah, uh, these poor people. <laughs> I feel sorry. This is a really cool animation, though. Yeah, have fun down there. So far, pretty easy. Yeah, I was saying fireworks. Or big explosions. <laughs> Don't mind me. Huh? What I was saying? You crazy. 
I did not saw the map properly, so I don't know which like country is this supposed to be the Dakia. Because I would need to like see the map properly. I saw Italy there, but like I didn't saw exactly which kind of country or country at that time this was supposed to be. Damn it. Right? But okay, this was pretty fun. Again, Tanya is crazy as heck. Uh, she's doing pretty well with her battalion. She's very daring, but like, yeah, these people, uh, they are only on the ground. So they are very easy target for them. Yeah, and it seems like they have no, like, yeah, like, damn, uh, magic, air, whatever, people. So, yeah, they are just kind of there, left for a slaughter. Whoopsie daisy. Yeah, they have a very big advantage. <laughs> Tanya and her battalion have very big advantage against this people. And they even like went so far away they were able to like I guess it was their capital and destroy like some important how is it what they were saying? Um in industrial things, uh, things which are making things. Uh, oh my god, I forgot <laughs> the word for it. But you know what I mean. So they destroyed important stuff, I guess, for weapons and this kind of things, right? Or something like that. So yeah, uh, that's going too hard. The poor people of Dakia. And I, I guess. Uh, it would be achievement for Tanya, I guess. But like again, they might throw her somewhere where it is more dangerous than this, so she would be in trouble again because like she wants kind of easy life, easy work, and not like doing dangerous stuff because she might die. Yeah. So so far this this was pretty good, right? They had a big advantage, and like these people down there on the ground really couldn't do anything. <laughs> To them, right? Because they were so high up and they also have magic, so it's very easy for them to fight them. But like, if they are going to be facing similarly strong opponents, that might get tricky. Yeah. We'll see. We will see. So I'm going to give this episode 7.5 out of 10. And... I mean... For now this worked, but... We'll see if Tanya will get herself in some shit again, <laughs> right? Yeah, but she's so crazy, oh my god. <laughs> she's so goddamn crazy. But like, hey, she warned him. She warned him. She issued a warning. It was their problem they did not listen to it. <laughs> That's one way how to do it. I'm not gonna lie. Not going to lie. I kind of like it that like she's still doing stuff how it's supposed to be done. But she knows how to kind of go around it. Right? Yeah. Tanya does really get things done. Oh my goodness. <laughs> she's such a cold bitch. But like, yeah. But there are things are really getting done. Not gonna lie. And I really like the girl. Like, she's kinda cute, but apart from that, she's quite smart also. Like, yeah, she's obedient, but she knows when she's supposed to do certain things. Like, when Tanya was, like, talking about stuff, she, like, went in and started digging hole. <laughs> like, yeah, I know what's coming. <laughs> I wanna know what's coming. <gasps> yeah, I guess that's why she survived. <laughs> She she good at picking things. <laughs> Very helpful. <gasps> so I wonder like if we will get more of other characters. But Binx haven't appeared for a little while. So I wonder when he's going to be like messing things up. Yeah, because previously he was quite a douchebag, not gonna lie. So I feel like he's going to appear again soon. Yeah, well, I guess that's all. Goodbye and see you next time.